Awareness, Conversations with the Masters, is a profound work by Jesuit priest Anthony DeMello, which encompasses teachings on spirituality, self-awareness, and enlightenment as conveyed through a series of lectures and discussions. DeMello's essential message is that most people live their lives asleep, trapped in their conditioning and unconscious patterns that limit their experience of life and true happiness. DeMello starts with the premise that lack of awareness is the root of all suffering. He asserts that people are asleep because they are not aware of their reality. They go through life mechanically, acting out scripts given to them by their culture, society, family, and personal conditioning. He challenges readers to wake up, to become aware not only of the world around them, but also of their inner selves, their thoughts, emotions, and reactions. To break free from these patterns, DeMello suggests a path of self-observation without judgment. By observing oneself, one can start to see the automations and become free from them. He stresses the importance of detachment, asserting that true happiness can only be found when we learn to detach from our desires, our attachments, and our aversions. DeMello points out that it is not the object of our desire that enslaves us, but the desire itself. True freedom comes from letting go of these desires and experiencing life and reality as they are, without the interference of our preconceived notions and biases. According to DeMello, love is often misunderstood. What many consider love is more akin to dependency or attachment rather than actual love. He claims that most relationships are based on the fulfillment of one's needs and are conditional. Real love is not self-seeking. It is freeing for both the individual and the object of their love. Love can only be experienced truly by an individual who is awake, free from attachments, and capable of seeing the other person for who they truly are, without projections or conditions. Throughout the book, DeMello also emphasizes the importance of understanding that most of what we believe to be happiness is illusory. He posits that society has conditioned individuals to chase after symbols of happiness, wealth, success, approval, and relationships, without ever questioning whether these things truly bring lasting happiness. DeMello suggests that happiness is actually our natural state, one that is uncovered when we strip away our illusions, desires, and false beliefs. Another key theme in DeMello's teachings is the distinction between reality and our perception of reality. Our thoughts, opinions, and judgments distort the truth of our experiences. To perceive reality clearly, one must see things without the filter of our conditioning. Awareness is the tool for this clarification, as it allows us to perceive things more directly. One of the radical ideas presented by DeMello is that change is not necessary for personal transformation as much as understanding is. He argues that attempting to change oneself without understanding is futile. Once understanding is achieved, change happens spontaneously. Thus, self-awareness brings about transformation effortlessly. DeMello also addresses the topic of death, remarking on the Western culture's awkward relationship with it. He encourages a confrontation with the concept of death, using it as a lesson in detachment and the impetus to live more fully. By fully embracing the reality of death, individuals can live with greater presence and appreciation for the moment. A crucial aspect of awareness, as noted by DeMello, is having insight into the games people play. Ego-driven behaviors, power struggles, and emotional manipulation are pervasive in human interactions. By becoming aware of these games, an individual can choose not to participate in them, thereby experiencing greater authenticity and inner peace. DeMello often utilizes anecdotes, parables, and jokes to illustrate his points. These stories are not mere entertainment, but are meant to provoke self-reflection and insights. He encourages a questioning attitude, inviting readers to examine their beliefs and to discover what is true for themselves through direct experience, rather than through adherence to dogma or doctrine. Spirituality is another important concept explored in the book. DeMello distinguishes between organized religion and true spirituality. For him, spirituality is a direct encounter with life, unmediated by beliefs or theories. Spiritual practices and religious rituals are only of value if they enhance one's awareness and help one to live in the present moment. Ultimately, DeMello's work calls for radical inner transformation through increased awareness and consciousness. 
He guides the reader towards understanding that true happiness, love, and freedom are not found in the external world but within oneself. By shedding false identities, societal conditioning, and personal preconceptions, one can live a life of awareness in a state of unending joy and contentment. In conclusion, Awareness, Conversations with the Masters, provides a compelling narrative that encourages self-exploration and inner transformation through awareness. Anthony DeMello's insightful discourse on the nature of reality, happiness, love, and spirituality offers practical wisdom for anyone looking to break free from life's illusions and experience the fullness of life in its purest form. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.